we asked individuals that were living with HIV on treatment whether they had had the discussion of U equals U with their HCP. Essentially, those individuals that had that conversation of U equals U with their HCP, compared to those that were not aware of U equals U, were significantly more likely to report biological suppression, treatment satisfaction, they were significantly more likely to be aware that treatment does prevent transmission, they were significantly more likely to report improved sexual, physical and mental health, but one in three were not aware, and one in three is quite high. And so therefore, if you are not proactively having this conversation with your patients, HIV positive or negative, then you're doing them a disservice. The relationship between a health provider and his or her patient is really one of the most sacred things we do in medical care. While we talk a lot about various treatments and laboratory tests and diagnostics and, and such, that interaction is probably one of the simplest things we can do to improve both the, the quality of the medical outcomes, important outcomes like adherence to medications and viral suppression, but also things like quality of life, things like sexual health. And what it really says is that that, that sanctum of the doctor-patient relationship is really an important and valued influencer in the lives of the people we look after, the quality of life, way past just the kind of conventional medical outcomes. This study is so important uh, because it's now linking knowledge of U equals U or being informed by your healthcare provider about U equals U with the person living with HIV's treatment outcomes. So improved treatment satisfaction, optimal adherence, a viral suppression. How can we get people to be more empowered about the treatment and be more confident to have these discussions with their HCPs on both sides, Bruce? This is still new information for, for many people. It's a radical challenge to what we've known about HIV and people with HIV. So it's really about getting this message out consistently through different channels, through whether it's the medicine associations or the medical journal. We have to make sure that all the sort of global international HIV and AIDS organizations are sharing it, health ministries are sharing it, that there are uh, messages out in popular culture, and that we really target getting this out to not just people living with HIV, but to healthcare providers, policymakers, and the public. So one of the most important things about the positive perspective studies is it shows us very much how valuable having the conversation about U equals U and sexual health in the clinic on a routine basis is. The improvements in adherence, the improvements in viral suppression, the improvements in self-reported health outcomes is, is immense. And it can be done with, with the simplest interventions and it should be done as a matter of routine, both at the, in the clinic and as a matter of implementing into policy. I have a very easy call to action share the message, share U equals U with not just your patient, with your provider, but with everyone you know. This is transformative news. It changes the lives of people living with HIV and it changes the field. But only if people know about it and people with HIV have access to the treatment and care to experience it. So please share U equals U.